Just trespassing right now. Hey, this is Jordan. Hey, this is Dee. Hey, this is Gaden. Hey, this is Ava. This, this is Phineas. And this is our GWM Cannon, towing our three-ton caravan around Australia. What have you found, woman? Where the rainforest meets the beach. Oh, that's, what they say, isn't it? that's exactly what they do say. We're just on the side of the highway. Welcome to another episode, guys. Hello. Hello, there you go. Hello there, everybody. Smack my glasses with my face. She'll get, That's there. A good start. She'll get there. Um, we have an episode here where we're heading up to um, Port Douglas. We're staying at Daintree uh, Caravan Park or Daintree Beach, Beach Resort. Resort. Um, now, yeah, so behind me, we just pulled over on the side of the road because it was like literally rainforest and beach. It's like we're on some sort of um tropical island right now. Is this amazing or what? If all the people weren't there, we'd look like castaway. Oh, true. Wilson! Oh, yeah, Caden cries. Yeah, cries over that movie. Um, now, yeah, we're heading up to that uh, Port Douglas spot. We're going to check out we're the Daintree Rainforest. We're not allowed in this beach. What's that? Think your pardon? We're not allowed in here. Uh, only Australians. No, oh. Because you're Kiwi. No, no Kiwis allowed. Are we allowed in here or no? It's a swim. No, it's crocodile swim, bro. There's crocodiles and sharks and all kinds of crap, man. You don't swim nothing. But where are you supposed to, um... I don't know, we want to go and start out where we can go snorkeling, but I just don't know how that's going to work. So how do you sw how do you snorkel on the Great Barrier Reef? Why well, don't they go there? You gotta, there's a flight that flies you over to Exmouth, and then you go snorkel in Exmouth, and then you fly back. I don't know how you snorkel. I don't want to go on a boat tour. No, what I'm saying is why are you allowed to snorkel on the Great Barrier Reef? This is a lot. I don't. Really, I don't even know that. The the crocodiles in the Great Barrier Reef must leave you alone. Just like the sharks in Exmouth. Remember? Oh no, the sharks leave you alone here. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, we're going to show you the rest of whatever we're going to go and show you. So enjoy that. This is the Captain Cook Highway, and it's a really, really nice drive. The whole way's been like this, right next to the ocean. It's good, yeah. Sure is, Jordan. It's my favourite. What are you talking to me? I don't know who I was talking to, babe. You were but thank you for responding. That wasn't me. <laughs> right, check it out, Phineas. We're hooking in and we're pulling up to the Dane Tree Beach Resort. Um, this looks like the bee's knees of any caravan park you've ever seen. Look at the driveway. That's so beautiful. We are going to um, Cape Tribulation. Uh, we're going to check out this rope uh, rope course or something there before we zip buy the tickets for it because last time we did anything remotely close to sort of zip lining and stuff, the kids were petrified of it. Um, it's very expensive, so I don't want to go there and then spend all of our money for the kids to bail out on us. Um, so we're going to check it out. We're going to check out Cape Tribulation. Um, and just, I don't know, do that today. We're just about to do the um, ferry across to um, Cape Tribulation and Daintree and all that. So there's a ferry that you've got to take to go back and forth where we're staying. Um, shout out to Luke, old mate camping across from us. He had a uh, 10 ticket pass or something. He's only used like three of them. Uh, and he gave me the rest of the ticket. What a legend. So now we're going to have free access to the ferry and happy days. Because that was like a hundred bucks. So yeah, thanks Luke. Shout out, great, great legend, mate. Cheers. Gotta love the travel community, hey. Right. He could have just thrown that in the bin and said, "Ah, stuff this bloke." Just... 
Ah, full health, mate. You're a legend. Um, so yeah, yeah we're going to do that now. I'm going to throw the drone up and I'll try to get a little bit of us going across the uh, ferry. I, I reckon that'll be quite cool. So yeah, we go. Drone. I hope you enjoyed the drone footage, but look at us now, look at this. That is, this is a cute ass road. Cute ass road. Once again, thanks Luke, because it's $47 return for just a car for one day, right? So, now we get to come twice, like, legend man, I'm so happy. Huh? We're lucky. 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 Woo! It's literally water water's coming down off the road. And there's like water, water, I don't know, there's water everywhere. That was awesome. We're in the rainforest, baby. Yeah. Kids up. Uh, we are doing the Daintree Rainforest, a bit of a sky walk, and then you go up to like a really tall tower. Uh, it's all at the Daintree Discovery Centre. Uh, we've all got these little necklaces. Yeah, there you go. Or you can just hang on to it, whatever you like. Um, but yeah, we're going to go for a walk around and I don't know, listen to these things, and is it going to tell us all the goods? You have to run up. We both came around the corner, that scared the crap out of us all. It scared me first. Hey, hello there. And I had to scare Katie with it and then scare Abe with it. Oh, That's so good. Skip road to the We're in the dinosaur park area. Okay, so behind me, this is called a strangler fig. It's 500 years old, mate. Look at that. Get me hands out of it, huh? Get me hands out of it. Um, for 500 years old. Far out. How's that, Kate? Awesome. Someone's left their uh, comfy deck chair cover here. Um. All right, we're gonna get to get out of here and uh, keep heading up to Cape Tribulation. I'm gonna check out some more stuff and show you all that. The catch is all there. Exit. Hey, look at Finny. You having the best life ever? Are you having the best time ever, Finny? Just head out the window, looking at all the palms in rainforest. We just smacked a Yui because Danica found a palm farm. We're gonna have a quick look in there and see what it's all about. Little ducks, little chicks. Danica's found it's a cool little spot. There's full of chickens and little baby chicks. <laughs> what happened? I've got one put in the front of it, so that when it's getting and it's kind of a dumb. Finny doesn't know what's going on with these animals over here. I really want to get a chicken. I really want to get a chicken. Oh, sorry. Mmm, yum. Tiny chicken. It's 
Did he get his lunch count? Adventurous? <laughs> so he's <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Oh, I'm full of food. We're gonna go hit the road and find another spot to show you guys. Welcome to Cape Tribulation. Let's get that. Oh, it's perfect. I got that perfectly. Um, we just about to pull into this adventure place. It's got these uh, rip, uh, rip, they call zip lines. Oh my god, look at this little cute little pub in there. That's a cute little cafe pub. Um, zip lines. So we're gonna check it out, see if the kids actually will do it. Um, and then just suss it out from there. If they go slow. Okay, they're not gonna go slow, my boy. Oh. They're gonna get. We haven't booked anything in the car park's full. I don't know what we're doing here, but we're gonna check it out. Come on. Hey guys, how are we? Alright, we just pulled into Cookie Lookout to have a look at. Oh. All right, we're just going to start this walk up to the bit of a lookout. Instagram mum. <laughs> Don't know where to exercise finish today because all the beaches, all the crocodiles, all the people, here he comes. Yay! <laughs> Smash straight to the camera, you goose. Alright, yeah, put him back on. Oh, Kaden's found a little hidden beach just for us. No, it's the other people, mainly just for us. Go for it, bud. Yeah. Can you tell you climb up there as fast as you can? Okay. Caden is way up high in this tree. All the way up there. What are you doing all out there, buddy? The other eleven gives something from Well, I hope you like our Wheels by the Ocean sand blasting weapon of mass happiness. Danica. Mass happiness. Happiness. Wow. Um, it's getting to the end of the day and we need to hit the road and get back across the ferry and back to our campsite. We've got till midnight, babe. We do have till midnight. <laughs> the ferry doesn't stop going until midnight. So we do have some more time if we really wanted to. Um, I don't know what else we want to see up here. It's freaking, everything you look at is beautiful. I want to go horse riding. I know me too, that'd be awesome. Double G Beach. We're just gonna check out one more little beach before we head back because it's, you know, we're high up in the uh, in the atmosphere, so we need to check it out quickly. Majubi Boardwalk. Mud Ujubi. I don't know. I'll say it in a sec probably. Dub Uji. Dub Uji Boardwalk. I'm gonna go go for a wander and see what's down here. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. I'll tell you one thing about the Dane Tree that's like the free spots you can go to, it's pretty much dog friendly everywhere. There hasn't really been a sign that says no dogs except for on the beaches because crocodiles. What on earth? 
That is sick. Okay. So I saw a baby turkey. I saw um like like about two fishes jumping out of the water, and that's it. Well done. The parents saw nothing. I also spotted the red tree. Okay. Oh, right oh my gosh. It must happen all the time. There's vinegar at the beach. Well, this is a party going on down here. It's not what I was expecting. I wasn't expecting a party. This didn't feel like nothing I was going to be seen out. There is a lot more people than I thought was going to be down here. <laughs> Coming here for sunset or something? First. Somebody already drank all the milk from that one. Oh, okay. <laughs> Singing it. Oh. <laughs> all right, that concludes our day one at Cape Tribulation. We're back on the uh, the ferry dog, heading across again. We are actually moving, I don't know if we're moving or not. Yeah, we are. Are we? We're actually moving, yeah. <laughs> I have to double check that four times. Um, that's got a quadruple check. Quad check. Um, all right, we're going back to camp and uh, we'll catch us in the morning doing whatever else we're doing tomorrow. Cheerio then. All right, I love you. Yeah, good morning. Good morning. We're uh, about to hit the Port Douglas. Hi! Hi! Port Douglas! Hang on, I need to be on it. Port! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we're about to go down to Port Douglas, have a look around those areas. Um, Ava and I are going to go on a little date together, and Danica and Kate are going to get a little date. You know, you need those times for yourselves. Um, I want time with her. It'll, it'll, it'll come. It'll happen, eh? It'll happen. Yeah. They just say the kids oh, get a cute little... It is cute. It is one cute. one because, you know, that's even hard to do on the road as well. But, um, I know you guys will find a cafe and I'll find a cafe. I hope so. If it works out. Or unless I'll just be uh, on the other side of the rest. Yeah. <laughs> Something. I, I hope I don't have to drive 15 minutes away and you guys already finished lunch by the time me and Ava find a cafe. If that's the case, yeah, we'll just go opposite yeah. side of the restaurant. Um, and we've got Woolworth shopping to pick up, which Danica ordered boring. all the bread. No, it's not, it's not boring because you ordered all the bread. We got bagels, we got bread, we got bread, we got bread, we got rolls, we got bread. I got English muffins because you like to have an English muffin one morning, bagels another morning, or a bagel burger. Then I got Slovaki oh, yeah. bread for the lamb Greek. Oh, I love Greek. She makes um, the gyros. Gyro, gyros? The gyros. Gyros. gyros? gyros. <laughs> all the bread, all the bread, man. All the bread. <laughs> Mate, you'd be a little bit scary, scarce on your motorcycle over there. Um, we're just pulling up. What's the spot called, Danny? Um, Shannon something. Shannon something. Shannon Vale. We're just pulling up Shannon Vale. This there, is the causeway. Apparently, this is a, a um, swimming spot. Look at that, we're driving. Oh, this is cool. The random stuff you find because of wiki, eh? Hell yeah. Just driving through all that. Oh man, that, that is cool, that is cool. Um, this is just Shannon Vale Causeway. You've just seen us drive across it because we're mad dogs. Um, Kaden is going to go and do the rope swing. Go on, bud. <laughs> but how? I don't know. Go do it, quick. How, Dad? I don't know. I think you have to swim over. <laughs> swim over and grab it. It's going to be fine. Look how clear the water is. You'll be able to see the crocodile come right for you, Cades. But then how do I run away from it? It is nice and clear. There's just old mate doing just a regular thing to do. I'm over here recording it and making it look all cool and stuff. It's just a regular thing people do every day probably to get to their houses. Oh, I thought it was really cool. And as you know, I missed out on the Ivanhoe crossing because it was shut when we were there. So that ruined me. So this was my Ivanhoe crossing to send. All right? Yeah? Can you reach No, I'm not going to be able to reach that. Are you actually going to do the rope swing? Yeah. You have to go check how deep the water is before we go and you just go and jump in it. No, I don't just jump in it, Dad. I hang on the rope swing. You should go and get it. You're crazy, bro. <laughs> oh. um, I'm 99% sure he's not going to do this, but if he does, I'll show you. 
No, he didn't do it. But anyway, he, here's the uh, little walkway. I don't know where it goes to, but oh my god, it's freaking everywhere in this entire area is like cute rainforest. Every single place you look at. Like literally, you could go, you could be like, oh, I'm going to live in the rainforest. And also, in the same day, you could walk out the driveway to your beach. <laughs> you won't believe it, we have found a chocolate factory. Oh, it's open. It's open. Wednesday to Saturday. Yeah, the boys. It's open. Oh, how cute. Cafe. I want to sell cafes. Yeah, buddy. We're here at Willy Wonka's Chocolate Factory. <laughs> Now you can go in and show them all, all around the place, Tess, if you can. Okay, it's going. Do a man. Hey, Ava's face. Ava's face got splat. <laughs> Who was that? Anyone over here? No, I cleaned my face. Please come in. Air conditioned. Chocolate oh, tasting. Okay. I like chocolate. So I'll buy a little sushi. Okay. Do a chocolate tasting. Welcome, okay. ladies, for spice. No, no, no. Hmm? Spikes. I don't know what that means. There you go. Oh, it's chocolate. Let's hope that's not chocolate. Oh, it's chocolate. Alright, see you later, guys. Me and Ava. Me and Ava, where are we going? Yeah, see you later. Enjoy, you Enjoy your date. Wow. See you. Wouldn't wanna. See ya. Baby. 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 You win. Yeah, the chocolate comes from there. I don't know, cocoa trees or something. Trees, classic. So there you go. And then they have to do all the processing and make it into a yummy thing. Look, there's one that's open up. Hey, but you must have eaten it on it. All finished. If you come to this place, there's the seating area. If you come to this place, come down to this bit. This is called Cedar Circle. Yeah, it's a cute little, cute little seating area. Oh, that's cute, eh? She found a bird's nest and she put it in a tree. And then you get all these views. Should have eaten out here, eh? Yeah. How's your bird's nest? Oh, there it is. Look at that. It's perfect. Just like you. <laughs> Hello, that was a chocolate factory. See you later. <laughs> Bye bye. bye, -bye. Oh, bless, you. <laughs> bless you, Ava. Bye -bye. No, I don't know. Uh, we're just pulling into um, Port Douglas with all the palm trees all up the roads. Yeah, the boys and the girls. GWM sort of. Just saying. Just saying. Look at all these trains that are pulling out. Look at Danica. She's doing an Instagrams. You know, get on the Instagrams and watch the Instagrams. Get on YouTube and watch our YouTubes. And this is YouTube and this is Instagrams. The palms are good. And the train. But, um, that train's about to hit you, Katie. Watch out. Oh. Big, big friendly giant. All right, let's go and have a looky and suss out this area. Boat hire? Hmm. No, I bet not. Bet not. Just walking out of the markets on the other side of the marina. We're further the love heart, so we better get a photo with that. Then we dan. Why not, eh? Yeah, love heart photo. All right, we have found a sick lookout. We're gonna go check it out. Um, but it looks like some awesome steep hills to drive up. Um, so that's gonna be pimping. We're driving through rainforest again. What's up? 
People just will live in the rainforest, man. They're like, eh, whatever. Yeah, they don't care. They don't care at all, man. They should care more. Care, boys! That's who we are. That's who we are. Look at that. Oh, that looks a bit like Yeah, just then we'll probably just down there. Oh, we just found a little walkway down from the lookout that I don't know where it goes to. We had a look at a little map. It says something about a cruise ship viewing platform. Ah, oh, damn it. I think it almost fell off a cliff. Sorry, guys. So. How are you though? <laughs> In every way. <laughs> Cruise boat. <laughs> that's that's that um, boat that we just seen down at the marina. Oh, you took a photo of us. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Alright, this is Four Mile Beach we're pulling in right now to. We didn't go to the lookout, we just went straight to the beach. Four mile beach? Four mile beach boy. Alright, that's us. This reality. Reality? There's a reality back there. Oh there's a reality back there. I don't know. Are you supposed to record on the beach? I don't know. That's why I thought, let's walk away from everybody and then we'll do a little video of saying, you know. There's actual rules. I heard you can film anyone in public. You're in public. Right. Like you're on a public property. So you're allowed to. Not to say I want to. But <laughs> like. Are you allowed to? You know what to? people say about filming the police? They're like, we well, actually, you're in public property. Yeah. If you're out in public, you expect so like to be on... Like if you're in someone's house, ocean. that's their property, so you can't film them unless yeah. they consent. Is that right? Yeah. I mean, so I if you're in a, up, if you're in a public place, you don't need consent, is what you're saying? <gasps> Two crabs are going to have a fight. They're Where? not. Where? There's one. Crab? And there's the other one, and he just pulled up. Crab Crab sandwich. Alright, anyway, this is Four Mile Beach. Rocking and rolling. Check it out. Um, it's a super nice beach. People are swimming. There is flags. Uh, so I guess that swimming's okay here. There's uh, jellies in there. Oh, I do like a bit of jelly. I like how your top just changed since last time I was videoing you. Oh, I didn't want funny tan. I could feel it coming. Nobody wants funny tan. Um, uh, well, that was Port Douglas. We're going to go and check out another spot that apparently you can check out um, a wild saltwater crocodiles. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Do you want and to know another query I have? What's the other query, Danica? Why can't you come up with, like, not you, but why can't the they come up with, back. like, more fun names for beaches? Like, everything is, like, mile. Like, I get it. It's uh -huh. miles long. 40 mile Ooh. beach. Like, come on. Yeah, come on, guys. Come up with something better than 40 mile beach or 4 mile beach or mile beach. What do you reckon, Danica? Like, miles beach? Mm -mm. Kilometre. I don't care for how long it is. Like, I don't know, like, Palm Beach is already one. Palm Beach, done. No, I like the sound of that. This is Palm Beach. It's, it's not original. <laughs> uh, yes, hey, we are just on the side of the highway. Um, apparently on Wiki, this is a spot that we can see a wild saltwater crocodile. Oh, Let's go and have a look. Look how much fishing line is hanging over this electricity cords where people are casting in and accidentally get hooked onto the wiring. Wow. Okay. Um, I just was having a chat with some people um, that were just here a second ago uh, and they reckon that the crocodile was across the road and was sitting there up on the bank. Um, so I'm going to go over there and have a look and see if we can see it. Um, they said it just slid it into the water um, a few minutes ago. So yeah, we'll go and suss it down and see if it comes back. Oh, I can't see anything down here where the, the crocodile is apparently sitting up here on the dirt. Just in here. And um, before, but we might uh, Not to so brag. <laughs> um, we might throw the drone up and just have a fly around and just see if we can find any crocodiles swimming around anyway. I just flew the drone around everywhere. <laughs> I can't let us flew the drone around for 20 minutes. It's like drone for the trunk. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Alright, great success. We've got to see a crocodile. I can't believe I just flew the drone that whole time and it never came up. As soon as I just put the drone in the car, boom, here it is. Um, but anyway, there you go. You got to see it. Wild saltwater crocodile.
Bala Beach Nature Reserve has got the most beautiful palm trees we've heard. Don't mind the camera flying around everywhere, but look at all the palm trees. Organic coconuts for sale. You can buy a coconut, guys. Two bucks. How damn sick was that place? Anika came up with that awesome palm tree place. Um, that's literally somewhere else, some, like a resort or a hotel or something. We just drove in the driveway and boom, there's beautiful palm trees everywhere. Um, <laughs> I, I don't know. Uh, free point interest. Uh, you're probably not allowed to do that, but promotion to that place. Go and stay there because it looks very nice. Okay, so that's where you book and stay. Can you go in there with No, you can't go in there with a caravan. So park your caravan somewhere and then go and pay to stay in that hotel. So that's advertisement for us to get the photos. Yeah? Sure. I feel that's a good payment. That was, actually, that was our day in Port Douglas. Uh, it was really nice to see heaps of stuff today. It's been a massive, massive day. We haven't stopped, eh? Hey? We've just been exploring, exploring. Um, hopefully, we take a day off tomorrow. Danique is booked in with Kate and they're going to be doing that zip lining. When? On Friday. So in two more days. So tomorrow we're gonna have a day where we're just like relaxing, maybe do a bit of school um, and chill out. But um, that zip line is gonna be freaking sick for Danica and Kaden. Should be exciting. Yeah. I told you there was lots of bread. Look at this. This is a loaf of bread. This is bagels. This is Turkish rolls. This is a loaf of bread. This is a loaf of bread. This is muffins. This is pita pockets. This is bread. This is bread. Bread woman. Okay. I, I don't eat any bread. Don't judge us on the bread situation when you can judge us on the chocolate situation. Oh, yeah, what about the you chocolate know? situation? This isn't even full. Yeah. That, that's pretty low. This is per day, guys. This is how much bread and chocolate we eat every single day. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, we've been here for a few nights now, and we're finally going to go and check out the beach, which is like 100 metres that way. Hey, somebody built a pretty mean little shack here on the beach. Oh, you claim that one? Just be careful, that'll fall over very easy. How cool, people have been building this whole base. Check that out, little teepee. All the coconuts. Hell yeah. Oh man, Ava, that one looks cool. Looks so cool. This one looks like a dinosaur bones. Wow, that looks cool, eh? What? Someone's put a lot of effort into building these. Wow. How cool. Okay, I'm going back to Caravan quickly to get the drone because I've just like the beach is almost empty. We have been here for a while while the beach is empty. Random people start to show up now. But I want to fly the drone all the way down this whole beach side so you can see all these palm trees. And then to see how far out in the ocean I can go. Like, there's, there's reef all around these areas. I'd love to see... Um, so apparently the Great Barrier Reef's out here somewhere, right? So you can't really see it compared to like the likes of when we're in Exmouth and you're just swimming in the reef. It's like right there on the beach, it's amazing. Um, there is an outer reef that you can go to as well uh, in Exmouth, but I don't know, I, can't, I haven't seen anywhere around here yet that you would sort of snorkel straight off the beach. Uh, and then there's crocodiles around. I don't, I don't really know how you snorkel here. Um, but I'm going to send the drone out to see, well, see what we can see from up the top.
Cheese guys, cheese to our party. This is, look, this is how we homeschool. Good morning guys. Yes, I do have a flash new haircut thanks to this lovely lady over here. Aren't you just amazing? Um we just dri we're driving to the zip line because Danica and Caden are doing the zip line today um, via the ice cream factory. Now we've driven into Daintree Rain. Daintree Riverview Caravan Park by complete accident. So we've driven about, I don't know, 15 minutes past where I was supposed to turn off. Because I didn't put anything in the GPS because I was like, it's just down this road somewhere. So I pulled into this cute little town. I'm like, I'm on the wrong side of the road. Oh my God. Do you need me to drive? <laughs> oh, what the hell. All right, so we're going to keep going. Um, 15 minutes back the other way and then drive to the ferry, go across the ferry like originally planned. Eight. Sorry, Caden was back there wrapping him and him with his headphones on, so I had to. That was awesome. Very proud moment. Oh, we gotta go back across the ferry. Big, big lineup. Only about 100 cars. Oh, if you're leaning your hand there, apparently you turn the wipers on. Uh, we're just pulling in a four of Villa ice cream, so we're going to have a quick taste of some organic ice creams, huh? What flavour did you get? Chocolate. Chocolate, of course. And Kaden, what did you get? Dragon fruit. Yum. And I got coffee hazelnut for Danica and I. Oh, Where you got that? Thanks. How good is that? Anyway, we're going to give them all a try. Yummo. Where's the next spot? I don't know yet. Oh, that was yum. We're out of here. Oh yeah, Dane Tree Ice Cream Company. Just what we need is an ice cream company. Let's go get some more ice cream. You haven't had ice cream in ages, you lucky boy. Um, this is my, my second one today. <laughs> yeah. We just went ice cream and then we were like, oh, another ice cream place. Let's get more ice cream. Hey, Avery. Mm, yeah. Ice cream all day. Yeah, you get ice cream all day. Oh, that was some more delicious ice cream. That was Daintree Rainforest Ice Cream Company, I think. Daintree Ice Cream Company, sorry. Oh. Is it, I don't know, cute oh. gardens. We're gonna have a little walk, yeah? I don't know where to. Oh, no. I, think, I think this is the end of it. Oh but we gotta, we gotta walk off this ice cream. Oh, All right, we're having a little walk through the Madja, or Madja, um, Rainforest Boardwalk. It's all, all around us, look at us. We're having some sandwiches while we walk. That's what we do. Because um, we don't want to be late for these guys' zip line. So we're just sort of killing some time now. There's a crocodile just on the shore. Just through the bushes there. Zoom in and find it. It's these trees here. Where's the sun? That tree just covered in like leaves. It's like a hairy tree. It's so cool. Yeah. Alright, let's get this families over to the zip lines. Yeah, green dinosaur. Oh, green dinosaur eggs. Oh. oh, we just pulled into the treetop adventure park. Danica, you look quite excited. Kaden, what are you thinking, mate? Excited. Yeah, you pretty happy? So excited. Oh. Alright, you're, you're going to be in control of some of the filming. Yeah. So, Kaden's Kate, oh. going to have this lanyard around his neck because I'm just testing it at the moment. And then you can do some filming. Yeah. Look, there's the bus. The bus is pulling in. That's your guys' bus, mate. Yeah. Have fun, buddy. Have fun ziplining all around the world. <laughs> yeah. Not around the world. Okay. Well, we're going ziplining. Have the best time. We're going ziplining. Me and you. Me and you, baby. Bye. All right, Ava and I have just pulled into the horse shop. What are we going to do while we're waiting? And we're driving in and there's just horses walking all over the road. How freaking beautiful. Hello! Cutie. Being really angry because I speak to a different animal, aren't you? Hello, beautiful. We just had a chat with the man at reception. Really, really nice dude. Just said for insurance purposes, Ava's not allowed to be under 10 um, to do anything at all. So even any small rides. Hey, Aves. Wait, he said we can come over and say good day though. Yo, what's up? Um, Ava and I are out on the Bloomfield track. 
um, or right, right at the start of the Bloomfield Trap. We're only going to do a little bit of it. Um, we just went across the river crossing, and there's heaps of people around, and all these people were like walking it and stuff. But we just smashed it, didn't we? Look ahead, Ava. Is that another river crossing pumpkin? Oh, yeah, buddy. Look at these river crossings, man. Look at us, we're going to go to the river crossing. Whoa, that's a pumpkin. I'm recording. 100%, right? Wow, I can catch up the time. All right, what did you think of that, Avi Pants? Yeah, that was cool. We did river crossings, we drone footaged it. Uh, we did some of the Bloomfield. Now we're gonna go back and find a field to go and play Kipo with, hey? Kipo. Kipo. We're gonna play Kipo. I'm gonna be the wolf. Kipo, Kipo! And I'm gonna be Kipo the Mega Jaguar. <laughs> uh, we're going. We're going. Where are I can't wait. <laughs> we're all shut up. We're ready to go. Can't wait. Second guessing my phone. Your helmet, everything else back in the pocket. Weep. <laughs> no, I done it wrong. Okay. Cool. I'm gonna show you this bit. All right. Can everybody come around so they can see me, please? I have to show them this little pocket here. And boom, the family's back from the zip line, just like that. Um, what happened, Caden Swa? Um, I got scared. What do you mean? I got scared. Little baby. He did. He got he got too scared, and then what happened? Um, and then we had to leave. Yeah, and how'd you get back? By so going on the bus again. Yeah. So you guys, what you, you got to the top of the zip line, and yep. what happened? Um, I got scared. We saw someone go over on the cable thing. Um. And they fell off and died. So you yeah. thought, oh. So I'm better not. <laughs> Nobody died. Hey, <laughs> Caden. All of the people that you were just on the zip line with all just died in a tragic accident. And only you and mum survived. Final destination right. shit right there. You guys just cheated death. So now you guys will be having to uh, be next. Be next, yeah. So you just gotta watch out. Don't drive near us. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. No, but seriously, um, they were lovely about it. Um, and then one of the people um were like saying nice stuff and saying you can do it yeah he was really nice so he goes do you want me to help you through it do you want to go in front of me are you sure you don't want me to make you go last he was really really sweet about it and he goes i can help you because you can't do it i'm like baby what do you think and he goes no nah. he was really scared oh buddy so gentle pushing obviously we're miffed we missed out like and jordan lost his money whatever danica lost her money um but yeah, all that aside, I <clears throat> wasn't going to push Caden into a super uncomfortable position. Um, hey. Mm -hmm. I should have shoved him off. No. should have shoved him off. <laughs> And the ferry ride concludes the day. If I put it like this, it's going to really annoy mum. Mum said, well, one of the videos, the balls were right on the screen. There you go. Make a whole thing about it then. Right, ready? We're going to go and check out uh, Mossman, um, Mossman balls. There's some balls on your TV. <laughs> um, we're going to go oh, check out Mossman. What is it? I don't know. Mo Mossman? 
Some river. I'll show you when we get there. I'll tell you more about it. But wait. Good morning. We're going to do stuff. I'm a man. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's happened again. GWM the world. Oh, that was Mossman Gorge. Um, why do you, would you pay money to go on a gorge walk when you can see like a thousand of these for free? Um, anyway, that's that's for uh, that's the rich people walk. Us, yeah. us Povo people only do the free $9. ones. <laughs> we just decided to drive back into Port Douglas. Um, it's flat out. Sunday. It's Sunday, guys. Um, yeah, completely chockers full of people. Not really sure what we're doing today. It's not a fail, but look at look at every cafe just chockers full. Oh man! I'm trying to remember. This reminds me of Noosa. Wait, so, oh, yeah. yeah, in Noosa we did this as well. We drove in. It was like fucking moon. Sorry, there was bloody millions of people everywhere. Oh. I'm thinking we're going to go and eat lunch. Um, at a Macca's. Not, a, not at a Macca's, Anika. Well, look at this. It's oh. full. Is there a Macca's here? <laughs> Don't tempt me. <laughs> this is full. After finally finding nowhere to eat so far, we just pulled into the Sheridan, because we're rich like that, obviously, to go and see what they have for foods offers. It's going to be too much. We'll have to bargain our way out. They might have cheap scraps left over. Look at this. We're living it up like the rich, like the rich folks. We can't afford indigenous tours, but we can afford a meal here apparently. I don't know about that. Priorities. Right? <coughs> Priorities. You gotta eat. You gotta eat to stay alive. You don't need to go on indigenous tours to stay alive. We got crackers in the van. You're a cracker in the van. We got lots of Can't take these guys anywhere. Jordan's finally found his couch. This is this is, this is pretty much the size of a caravan that I'm looking for. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty much. <laughs> Look at this pool over here, Fancy like that. It's weird because no one questions you, so we could literally just dive in the pool. Who would question you? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I feel like I'm really just trespassing right now. So anyway, this is the Sheridan, in case you're wondering. Look around. Yeah. Okay, so, so this is more what you go to Port Douglas for, right? Holiday. Yeah. Okay, so, oh yeah, this was the other restaurant I was looking at, um, which is also closed. 7 to 11. Damn it. Okay, so that's that. And then there's the beach over there. Let's go check the beach out. All right, me and Tanika are just about to get married. This is the chapel. Yeah. Culinary classroom. I said to do classes. Oh, class, class, corn and wine pairing. What? This, this is the chapel, guys. We welcome you here today on the anniversary of the wedding of Danica and Jordan. No. Thank Ava you for Jordan. attending. Ava and Jordan. It's Ava and Jordan. Huh? I don't know what Ava's doing. Me and Dad are See, I can just come and sit here. I'm going to try to She's rough. 
Wow, look at this. Ocean's just there. Oh my gosh, that's at the show. Fuck, some idiot. So there's the beach. I feel like I'm, I'm literally in Bali or something. Here's the bell. The church bell. Right there in front of your face, it's right here. Oh Don't ring the can, I got the guy's coming, the guy's coming. The guy's coming, run. This is cute. Go poolside, eh? Foods. Well, this is this is this is special foods. Ava. Bunch of gear. Oh my god. Poolside. Poolside at the Sheridan. What's up? Hey, Ava. Hey, Ava. Hey, this is Jordan. This is Finian. These idiots. In the pool. We're gonna walk through reception. I'm gonna walk for reception wet. We have no towels. Well, that was us sneaking into the pools at the. Look at me. Put me on this. Oh, it was me. It's me. Anyway, we're gonna get going now. Why did we have to go on here though? Ava doesn't want to leave the couch. Look at her. She's like, look at all this space. I get to sit on this comfy couch. Hey. Imagine somebody playing a piano up on there. Man, I don't think you know how to play the piano, Ava. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, this place is this, is, this is a great place to sneak into. You should give it a crack yourself. Go in here. Let me try it. Alrighty, let's get out of here. Bye bye. Okay, that there. Alright, that was the Daintree Rainforest, guys. Mint campsite, this one. You check it out. Um, we just wanted to say a quick goodbye. So, guess what, Danica? What time is it? Okay, bye. Bye. bye.